Young Capuso actresses Kate Valdez and Kyline Alcantara have proven their acting mettle by taking on diverse roles, from straightforward to significant and yes, contrabida, villainous, to beta, female lead. In Shining Inheritance, the first local adaptation of a K-drama series in the GMA Afternoon Prime, which premieres today at 4 p.m., Kate and Kyline come together to bring the characters Inna Villarazin, the Beta, and Joanna de la Costa, the Contrabida to life. It's a reversal of roles for them, which is in contrast to their 2019 film, Black Lipstick, where Kyline was the lead. When I learned that Kyline was also part of the project, I got excited. Nakasama Keo Nasia S.A., Black Lipstick, I worked with her in the movie, where she was our lead, star, said Kate in a recent press conference for Shining Inheritance, adding that it thrilled her because she wanted to work with Kyline again in which the latter would portray a character that stands in the way of hers. I'm really grateful, and I'm thankful that she is Joanna to my Inna, shared Kate. I'm able to create and form my Inna because of how she has built Joanna and how she breathes life into Joanna. I'm happy to be able to have worked with you. Kyline. For her part, Kyline also expressed gratefulness to Kate, whose portrayal of Inna has complemented and completed her depiction of Joanna. The production notes on the GMA Entertainment page describe Joanna as a spoiled brat, which is a stark contrast to Inna's kind and responsible nature. Doing dramatic scenes is tough, but if you're with Kate and the rest of the actors here, who are really good, anything challenging becomes easy, said Kyline. Thus. The Sparkle GMA artists are up for the challenge to do some intense sequences that showcase the emotionality and personality of Inna and Joanna. It's a way to present a sense of realism to the audience. Prior to getting into their characters and giving a highly emotional scene a go, the two stars would seek each other's permission and collaborate on how to go over it, shared Kyline and Kate. It speaks of their dedication and professionalism when it comes to their work. Veteran actress Coney Reyes can attest to it. She shared that the two have their own ways to play a role, but they're serious with it. They know what they're doing. They're studying, said Coney, who is delighted and proud of working with the young bunch of talents featured in the series. Since Joanna is a far cry from the beta role she has played before, Kyline was also asked about portraying Contrabida this time. Becoming Inna on screen, on the other hand, has allowed Kate to further see the clear distinction in essaying a lead role. There's a big difference, shared she. To deliver what's expected of her, Kate needs to focus on her role, but she gives herself the time to take a break, particularly during rest days, from inhabiting the life of Inna. Regarding the pressures of being the lead star and the possibility of being upstaged by others, Kate never thinks about them. Her goal is to do justice to her role. One of the signs that she's doing the right thing, or on the right track, is the approval of the show's director and writers. It only means that they're happy with her portrayal, the Shining Inheritance story will revolve around the three families of Villarazin, De La Costa and Abrigo. According to its webpage, Aurea, the owner of De La Costa Food Corporation, has to figure out her rightful heir or heiress.